As everyone knows, Napa County um, has a very rich storied background in agriculture. We are an agricultural based economy. And so I would say over easily the last two years, the agricultural community in Napa County has endured a lot of challenges. They've endured wildfires. They've dealt with COVID. We're currently dealing with a drought. And through all of those challenges, I have had a tremendous respect for our farmers and farm workers in Napa County who've really rose to meet the challenge. They have maintained a selfless dedication uh, to Napa County, not only to the agricultural community, but to our community as a whole, um, doing everything from ensuring that you know farm workers are vaccinated, dealing with COVID, all the way to um, contributing um, to our local food banks. I mean, Napa County Farm Bureau has contributed over um, 22,000 pounds of food um, to the Napa Food Bank. Um, all through things that our young farmers and ranchers grow in Napa County. There are several thousand farm workers and farmers in Napa County. Like I said, Napa County is very much an agricultural based economy. Uh, but by far, even with the ag preserve that we have in Napa County, which is very unique to Napa County, um, we, our economy revolves around agriculture. If it wasn't for agriculture, I don't think we would be um, the, the really bridge story powerhouse that Napa County is throughout the world because the stat right now is 2% of the American population is comprised of farmers and farm workers. So you have 2% that is feeding the rest of the nation. That's how important it is. So National Farmers Day, I think, is a great way to really recognize the dedication that our farmers and farm workers have to our community.